Hello guys, I am Engineer Muhammad Adnan Khan and you are watching my YouTube channel Being Engineer. In this video lecture, we are going to calculate the cut length of a triangular stirrups or ties. As you see here, this is a triangular stirrup or ties and we have some uh, longitudinal bar over here, the hook, the stirrup or tie and a 135 degree bend. Now there are different types of bands and different their band deductions 45 degree band 90 degree band 135 degree band and the formula we are going to use to calculate the cut length of a triangle is 2y plus x plus hook length minus total band length now what is y and x that we are going to explain in upcoming slides you are requested to please watch the complete video and if you are new to my channel please subscribe it and press the bell icon to get video updates so let's get start our today's topic let's say we have a column and its dimensions are 350 millimeter into 450 millimeters that is one of the dimension is 450 millimeter and other dimension is 350 millimeter and the stirrup we are using is of a dia of bar 8 millimeters. The dia of a stirrup bar is 8 millimeters and concrete cover or clear cover is 25 millimeters. Now what is x? x is this length that is you can say the it is the base of the triangle as you can see here this stirrup is in the form of a triangle and x is the base of the triangle so x is equal to that is 350 minus 2 times of concrete cover that is we will subtract concrete cover from both sides to get the base of the triangle that is x is equal to 300 millimeters so x is the base of this triangular stirrup so what is h h is the height of this triangle that is equal to 450 minus 2 into concrete cover that is by subtracting concrete cover from both sides that is from here and from here we will get the height of this triangular stirrup that is in the form of a triangle as you can see here x is the base of the triangle height is the h is the height of the triangle and y is the hypotenuse of the triangle so now to find the hypotenuse of a triangle we will use the Pythagoras theorem which says that hypotenuse is equal to base square plus perpendicular square under the root. Now here we are considering it a right angle triangle so we divided the base into half that is x divided by 2. So by putting the values of x and h that is height of a triangle or perpendicular of a triangle we will get this hypotenuse which is 427.2 millimeters so as I have mentioned before that there are some bands and uh, some band lengths need to be deducted for calculation of length of a stirrup or ties now there are different types of bands that is 45 degree band and its band band length is equal to 1 times of dia of bar of a stirrup or tie other type of band is 90 degree and its length is 2 times of dia of bar the third type of band is 135 degree and its length is equal to 3 times dia of bar here we have only 135 degree band in triangular stirrup now there are two hooks as we can see here there are two, uh, two hooks and the hook length is normally taken as 90 or some at some places you can you will be see it as 10 times of dia of bar so now calculate band length as I have mentioned before we have only 135 degree band that is uh, one 135 degree band and here we have four uh, four number of 135 degree bands that is number one here number two this is number three and this is number four 
four numbers of 135 degree bands and the length of a 135 degree band is equal to three times of dia of bar of a stirrup so by calculating the value we will get 96 millimeter so bend lengths are equal to 96 millimeters in this triangular stirrup and now there are two uh, two hook lengths so one hook length is equal to 9d so two two hook lengths will be equal to 18d by putting the value of a d that is diameter of a stirrup which is 8 millimeter it will be equal to 144 millimeters so now by putting the values in a formula that is total length of a stirrup or tie is equal to two times of y plus x plus hook length minus total band length by putting the values that is 2 into y y is the hypotenuse of the triangle plus x x is the base that is 300 base of a triangle is 300 plus hook length which we have calculated in the previous slide and minus total band deduction which comes out to be 96 and by simplifying the value we will get 1292.4 millimeters is equal to 1.29 meters it's mean that we need the length of 1.29 meters of a bar to make this shape of a rectangular stirrup or tie